This is a Big Facts Network exclusive. BET Awards 2024 is Big Facts Live. We got the hip hop legends in the building. Common Pete. Rock, yeah. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? What's yes, on? yes. Good? Y'all good? Yeah, we, man, we good. We got man. Chicago and the Bronx on the couch. Yes, yes, this is yes. a big deal right here. Yes. Two, yes. yes. Two, people, two people with this game that seem to not age. What's y'all secrets, man? What's yeah, your what like. What's your game? Y'all music. still look like young music. niggas. Music. Okay. That's yes. young. Yeah, That's man. what's up. And, and staying in happy places as much as you can. Like, For I try sure. To get around good energy. Yeah, you know yeah. For sure. Eat Back. well, man. We, we could do that. Eat well. Yeah. Get the little things together. Like, yes. God first. Yes. And yeah. the music. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. It was like probably way overdue for y'all to link. Really, y'all have linked in the past, but yeah. really link and put it down. So, yeah. how did that come together? Well, man, I'm, I've been a super fan of, of pre rock, and it's been somebody who I always like. I just love their music. I love his music. Like him and Pete Rock and CL Smooth. CL Smooth, yes, like yes. But then just his production and his rhymes. So we have been friends and we worked on, you know, just a couple of solo like different things. Mm -hmm. Like something for his album. We did the song, the diss song I had against Cube. Peter produced that. But we we never did a, a whole project or did multiple songs. So it just came it just came a time where I was really wanting to to connect with, with him. I wanted to do some hip hop that just was feeding my soul and like what I thought like would be good for the energy out there in the world when it comes to hip hop. And we just right. connected. You know, similarities of to his story is the same. We you know, we've been friends for a while and had, you know, mm -hmm. aspirations uh of working with each other and it, and it, and it finally happened. I'm loving the outcome and the results of hard work. You know what I'm saying? What y'all think yeah. the current state of hip hop is right now? Um, from seeing it from both sides of the game, you know, then and now. Well, I feel like the only thing that's missing is like you know the elements of real music. You know what I'm saying? And um, I feel yeah. like they're all catching on now, even the young cats. And um, we're just here to reteach it. Yeah, that's all. Real yeah. shit. Yeah, and I, I think they're like. You know, music is always evolving. It's life, you know, and, you know, right. I think artists, young artists have been putting out great expressions of what music is. Right now, I feel that, like, man, it's real good with the with the battle that happened with, with, with Kendrick and Drake. It kind of mm -hmm. put the attention on, on lyrics a bit yeah. a bit more and just, yeah. that's that's hip-hop. A battle is hip-hop, bless yeah. you. And you right. know, it's like, Thank you. so to me, I think that the energy towards, like, hip-hop is, is, like, in its purest forms, is there now like, yeah. like and even seeing stuff that happened like during the 50th anniversary when i was going out to them performances mm -hmm. and seeing how many people were celebrating the culture young and old yeah it felt i was like yo this we can we can like evolve and, and and be like experienced artists and put out new fresh music yes you know all right what you, what you um what you think the key to longevity is like because you've been doing this shit for a minute like yeah. and on top of your game the whole way. How, how do you keep that type of longevity straight? Well, man, I, I mean, to me, it's about staying humble and, like, staying true to what you believe in. Like, it's, And that, that might change and expand, but you still know at the core, what it, what do you think? Like, you got to be able to look yourself in the mirror when it comes to what you're putting out there. And um, for me, it's about, like, staying, like, the more I know what my purpose is, the more I can, like, evolve. And, like, and, and you might see me as an actor doing something that's, like, that means something, like, and I'm gonna use that platform to do something. Even if it's an action film and I'm killing some mugs, it's still, it's still gonna be like, eventually I'm gonna use that to, to do something good, like, out there in the world. So to me, it's the overall thing is just staying in your purpose and like staying humble enough to know you gonna always learn. And it's gonna be ups and downs, man. I ain't, my whole career ain't been like, oh, every time I'm out, somebody, like, this has been one of the first album projects that people have been paying attention to that I put right. out in a minute, so yeah. I'm grateful to be working yeah, with you yeah, out yeah. there. <laughs> nah, man, right. That's the truth. You know, you, you, it's the truth, man. It's the truth. Hip-hop trivia. Have either of y'all ever did any type of collaborations with anybody from Atlanta? Um, anybody? I mean, you got Luda, you got Goody okay, Mob, you got, sure. you know, uh, for sure. Bone Crusher, okay. who I always yeah. wanted to work with. Um, no, he said, "Have you? Have you done? Did, yeah. Oh, yeah, have you done? No, this I'm 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 throwing it in the air. This is what I want. <laughs> out, especially yeah. Outcast, like you yeah, know, at least yeah, Big yeah. Boy or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Sleepy Brown, you know what I mean? Like those right. are the homies. So you know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. Right. I, I, I actually like worked with CeeLo a lot. Like CeeLo was one of them. Okay. Like, yeah, he yeah, he sang on a few few joints. Um, and I got to go 
work with Organized Noise, God Best the Soul of Rico. Rico, Rico. Yeah. yeah. Shout God out to Rico, Rico Wade. Wade. Yeah. So I got to go work with them, but we never, like, materialized the music. So, But I got a lot of love and respect for the scene down there. Yeah. You know, the artist is putting it down. Y'all develop y'all own sound down there. That's, yep. that's, yeah. that's, to me, that's always respected in this in this music, in this art form. Because I always look at hip-hop like, man, New York got they sound. West Coast had they sound. Atlanta got his right. sound. Chicago, we developed our sound. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's right. Dope. Yeah. Man, the shot, because you're one of the creators of the yeah, show, oh, yeah, shot, right? Yeah. That's one of the few shows that get better each season. I'm like, like, a lot of Thank shows you. start falling off, but it's getting better every season. Thank how, you. Long, yeah. how long you think it's going to last? Man, I hope it lasts, man, like, <laughs> as, long as, as long as law and order. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Law, 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 law. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yo, so, right. So as, a, as an executive producer on it, I got to shout out Lena Waithe, who created She wrote it. Um, and, and along with our whole crew, it's, man, I got to say this. I hope it continue to last, not only because, you know, obviously, I, you know, it, it's beneficial for me, but it's been one of the things that's been most important for me to be a part of because I be seeing people in my hometown working. Mm -hmm. like, I, I, like, they working, mm -hmm. like, people doing, working on the crew, working, doing makeup, doing hair, doing, yeah. like, it's, Lights, it's ill to see mics, like, yeah. all type behind-the-scenes stuff. Yeah. So it's, it's really been Free important opportunity. for me. Yeah, it's an opportunity. Right. So, yeah. As much as I like to be like, yo, the shine, I'm executive producer. The, one of the biggest things is like, it's giving my people some, some the job. opportunity yeah. that's given to the community. Yeah. Do yeah. you think? Do you think the uh, the movies and the films uh, got you more notoriety than, than the music? Like, I mean, I think it it, it it has got me more notoriety in certain areas. Like certain people, I remember I was I was working on the, on our album. I, I like I like riding in the car and writing. So I was in this guy's car, like like he was like a driver picking me up. And I was rapping because I was writing. And he was like, damn, man, I didn't know you rap. And I'm like, yeah, I rap, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah. So, I mean, my point is, it's some people who didn't know the music. But that's the beautiful thing to me is like, yo, he might get exposed to the music now. You, yeah. know, you mm -hmm. never know. And, um, you know, me going into acting with something pure and true to what I wanted to do as an artist. Yeah. That's why I said, like, stay true. Stay, you know, committed to what you want to do and your purpose and never know where it can take you. Yeah. Right. For so, sure. Yeah. What does BET mean to y'all? We had the BET Awards 2024. What is yeah, because y'all have been here to see it grow from the beginning. Mm -hmm. Is you know what I'm saying as opposed to some yeah. of the younger generation that's Prince coming in Dejour. on the internet and yeah. all that kind it's, of shit. It goes back from Prince Dejour for me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and what's his last name? Chris. Something. Chris. Chris. Yeah, I know it's Chris. You talking about yeah. the comedian dude? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. B oh yeah, yeah, yeah. BET means that. Plus, uh, Rachel. Oh, yeah. I mean, I'm naming everybody that yeah. I, I sat there and watched on BT, like, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. And so, the music <coughs> and the hip hop and, and, and what they, you know, they put us on a level, you know? They right. put all artists on a, on a level. So, I have to thank BET for that. All right. And, uh, I wouldn't be anyone without them. Yeah. yeah mm. for, for me, too, it's just like, it's been a true vessel and vehicle for us to, like, show exactly who we are unapologetic expression yeah, it's like it's this it's expression and and early on that the dream was to, to to get your video like on rap city or video lp or yeah. you know right. like and then it things starts to evolve you can i perform on team summit and then you started to have the bet awards and you want to be on that mm -hmm. and then they started having films and tv like so you want yeah like it's been an outlet for us for for so much and and bringing young old just all of who we are so i, I got a, nothing but love and i love that we can celebrate ourselves exactly yeah. exactly absolutely yes sir man, we appreciate y'all yeah. man it's an honor you know what yeah. i'm saying Thank please you. continue to bless us with great beats great film great music yes great yes, need yes. That. Uh, you know, yes. i want to ask one more question yeah. how hard is it to stay true to what like your sound how hard is that do you do you ever find out like i want to switch it up a little bit like the young do you ever hey did you ever get caught up in that I, I did for for a little while. Like, you know, um, I, I I just do it my way. Like, I'm a soulful guy, so I like soul music. Yeah. And so when I hear the trap beats, I just put it together in my head with what I do. Okay, yeah. And so yeah. Mm -hmm. that's how, you know, I'm I'm able to stay. Not follow the trend, but adapt to it. Yeah. I mean, yeah. To, yeah. It's, it, for me, it's yeah. easy, you yeah. know, because I've been doing it for so long. Not nah, for oh, sure. Shit. Yeah, I think, you know, for me, I try to learn and, and, and listen to it and, like, See, see where it could be most authentic mm -hmm. to, to me because I don't want to try to be anybody else but me. And I, and I don't, if, if something moves me, 
then that's I, I only move when I get inspired, you know. Yeah. So that's 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 basically to me how I try to evolve in in, in this music and, and just in life, you know. Yeah. yeah. Now nah, respect. Yes, sir. Love, love, love. Y'all. For love, sure. Appreciate you. Rock. BT Awards. Big facts live. Salute. Yeah. Uh,